A man who has been arrested four times this year for alleged mail and other thefts is back in jail on his latest charges. 26 year old Kagan Bazin remains in jail on nearly $15,000 in bonds, charged with carrying out stolen merchandise from a store, as well as theft and attempted theft of metals. One of his new charges alleges he and another man went into Atwoods on Loop 11 and Bazin walked out with a DeWalt pole saw valued at $240. And the other man walked out with a stolen hat under the beanie he wore into the store. Another charge alleges Bazden took two necklaces from the Walmart of Central Freeway on April 21st. An arrest on March 21st was for two alleged thefts at the Harbor Freight Store on the same day when police say two men walked out with three welders. Bazin's record includes a conviction and probation for $12,000 worth of vandalism to six WFISD buses. That was back in 2015. A few months later, he was arrested for vandalism of vehicles using a pellet gun. Another recent arrest was from an alleged theft in November when a homeowner posted video of a man pulling into her driveway, running up to the porch, and taking a Christmas package. The other man charged with working with Bazin on many thefts is Shane Waller, who has 12 arrests for theft since August. Waller is still locked up with more than $16,000 in bonds.